Rick and Nick coming at you with another road trip adventure, this time jet skis. That's right. We're going to be taking a jet ski tour about two hours long around all of Marco Island. Mm -hmm. It's going to be great. Two hours. What could go wrong? <laughs> How's it going? My name's Thomas. I'll be taking you guys out today. Um, are we all pretty comfortable on jet skis? We've all gone out with us. Yeah. Yep. Awesome. Um, so we did get some newer jet skis. They have a few more controls than our older ones. So I'll just go over everything just to uh, make sure we're comfortable with it. This right here is your kill switch. Same as always. Goes either right around your wrist or right through your life jacket. Uh, this one right here goes through your life jacket. The other one looks like a bracelet. Goes right around your wrist. Uh, for any reason you fall off, this will come with you. Pull out just like this. Will not start back up until you take this flat key right here. You just slip it right underneath this ring right here. Just slides right underneath there. On the top is the green start button. Hold this down, it'll fire right up. Every time you start it up, you will be in neutral. There'll be a little gear indicator right here, just to let you know you're in neutral. To get it into forward, all you gotta do is just tap your throttle right here once, just let it go, and it'll put you into forward. You'll stay in forward until you come over to this side right here. This one controls neutral and reverse. Um, to get it into neutral, all you gotta do is just We are underway. We get a few minutes of just play time out here in the water to get used to the craft before our guide will come out and take us on the actual tour. So let's go have a little fun first. Once we get past that swim buoy, we can open it up a little speed.
it's not picking up on the recording right now, but there's a great little blob under the water there. That is a manatee. Right there behind. Uh, they can grow up to be what 11 feet and a thousand pounds. And about five years ago, they were let off the endangered species list. They are a protected species, but no longer on the endangered list. Well, that worked out well. We're going to start up again and try to catch some mating, believe it or not. We'll see if we get lucky, if they're getting lucky. Spotted some dolphins and some other things up here. Might be another manatee, but I see dolphins up ahead too. Oh, oh I hope I got that. A dolphin just jumped out of the water. Another one just jumped out of the water. Or it could have been the same one, I don't know. <laughs> okay. There's two right up there by the tour guide. They're not jumping out of the water, they're just swimming. Dolphin show is over. Time to move on from here. Baby 
baby hammerhead. The third, this is only the third hammerhead he's ever seen. I can see it. I don't know if I got that on film. But <laughs> a little hammerhead shark. Okay, the tour's about over. Let's take this puppy in and recap what we saw today. Since I'm on the wave runner right now, let me do a little recap myself. So we had manatee, which I think I got a good shot of that. I dipped the uh, the GoPro under the water, so I think I got a good shot of the manatee there. Um, and then we went almost a whole tour without seeing dolphins, and we got to a group, and this one dolphin was putting on a show, jumping out of the water three or four times. I think I got that with the GoPro as well. And then at the very end. I don't think it turned out uh, filming too well, but there was a little baby hammerhead shark. So all in all, a very successful tour. Regency Water Sports here in Marco Island. We do it every time we come, but this year, what? Extra special, wouldn't you say? Oh my goodness. That was incredible. The best probably time we've ever been out. Yeah. Luckiest time. You were getting worried about the dolphins. Yeah, I was like, well, just because I was like, you know, I know we had seen them in the past and I was just worried are they okay? <laughs> and he's like, yeah, 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 it's all about the tides. Well, usually it, it, we'll see the dolphins early on in the tour. Yes. But this was at the end, but they were putting on a show. They did, I hope to goodness you got it. I think I did, I oh think so. Oh my God, it was incredible, it was so um, great. And so the, much fun. The new jet skis are so maneuverable. Yeah. Like, I ha was having a blast. I was standing up like for half of it, you know, just kind of doing little, you know, moves and stuff. I was having so you were, much you were fun. Crazy. You were yeah, crazy. I was getting a bit crazy. I was like wanting to jump the yeah, lake and everything. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Ooh, but we us. always yeah. like to do the tour rather than just renting jet skis and going back and forth on the beach. Yeah. Uh, you get enough speed on the tour and you get to go back in the mangroves and the guide will point out the uh, wildlife to you. So Exactly. Super fun. Regency <laughs> Regency Water Sports here in Marco Island. Highly recommend. That's so great. <laughs> I can't go back too much further because you're way shorter than me. I know. That's what I'm saying. I'm like trying to at least just keep my balance. Best thing I think I captured today, not the manatee, not the dolphin, not the little baby shark. What did you see? Uh, you've already seen it. The, the footage of me and my hat. <laughs> yeah, that was that the best was thing. About ridiculous. Yeah, we, so, as always, adventure is out there. You can find it on a road trip or a jet ski.